guys, welcome everyone to the Major Pod Network Twitch channel. Sorry for the little delay. Uh, I am your host, Matt Cardona, a.k.a. the Thousand Dollar Broski, a.k.a. the Michael Jordan of Wrestling Food Collecting, a.k.a. the man who is the star of Retro Mania. You're, you're the last person in the creator select screen. Full <laughs> disclosure, we're a little late because we just needed to make sure the controllers worked and stuff. We just got off boozing with the toys if you're... Uh, if you're not coming from that and you're just uh, watching us on Twitch, that's where we are. We, we kind of drink and hang out and buy figures and all that stuff. But I'm here, producer of the show, Smart Mark Sterling. and But we are joined by our good friends on the Major Pod Network, the Game Marks Podcast. Who are you guys? What's up? I am the man they call Johnny Clash. And I, your hand. I, have a <laughs> <laughs> I am Mr. <laughs> Anything is Feasible, the man of 1001 nicknames, George Feast. Um, um, now, guys, this is a little collab here. The Game Marks have joined the Major Pod Network. Major Pod Network launched February 1st. We are proud to have the Game Marks podcast on board. Um, and I'm going to make it official now. Um, I don't know if you guys know this, but we have FWF Live coming April 8th. And you guys are in action. Oh. Um, tag oh. team action. Any against- a weekend booking? Mania what? Weekend Booking against Mark's uh, co-host from the Off the Hop Rope Podcast. That's right. It will be the Off the Hop Rope Podcast versus the Game Marks Podcast. For the Tag Team Action. Now, George, I understand you're not a wrestler. Go to Creative Pro. Learn a hammerlock. Learn a couple yeah, holes. you got to learn something. We're training, John, we're training. John's, been, John's been teaching me some things on the side. I've been having a couple conversations. Co- COVID wrestling lessons. So, uh, hopefully, yeah. The teacher so of the you, you so guys over a, Zoom. <laughs> you guys have a Mania weekend booking. Congratulations. Let's do it. I'm ready. Last time I had one of those, I tore a hamstring. Let's uh, let's go. <laughs> well, uh, tonight <laughs> we're playing Retro Mania, a game that um, I think we've all heard about for a while. Kinda, Johnny and you know, George can tell us about the game, but real quick, Jungle Snake John, thanks for the subscription. Mr. Hokey, thank you. Doll6419, all subscribers. And there's a hype train going, level one, almost to level two. Uh, what's the deal with Retromania? You guys covered WrestleFest and WrestleFest 2. So what's going on? I mean, this is the... If you want to call it WrestleFest 2. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Before, before you get into it, can I say that I am the only person in video game history to be in two of the three... <laughs> WrestleFest games? That's true. No, you're wrong. Actually, Hulk and Animal are in all three. Oh, oh God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> but, Sorry, uh, but, they're kind of like the wait, stars of the game. <laughs> wait, but I'm the only one who's in two out of the three. Okay, sure. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, all right. Okay. Wait, was Morrison there in 2012? Ooh, he might. But he's. Uh, ooh, he might be in it. Yeah, he might yeah, be. He might. <laughs> uh, but to Mark, to answer your question before, uh, this is the official sequel to WrestleFest. So uh, Retrosoft, Mike Herman and the team over there, uh, great bunch of guys over there, incredibly talented, put this game together. Uh, We actually have an interview uh, in our archives with Mike talking just about the history of the game, his history uh, with WrestleFest and, you know, how this passion project turned into this living, breathing game that's being released in a matter of days and you know we are very fortunate to have uh an early access version of it but it is the most hyped wrestling game just because of the history and the just the unbelievable love for wrestlefest right yeah so you know um thank you for the subscription. my involvement in this uh once brian and i uh we left wwe like instantly i think it was like the day we left or maybe the next day we got hit up to be in this game um, and you know, I was like, eh, I'm not so sure, but wait, 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 it's the official sequel? Right. Wait a minute, it's the official sequel to WrestleFest? Because I grew up, you know, uh, playing that game over and over and over. I love that game. Like, when I close my eyes, I think of like Hasbro figure era, I think of that game. You know, it was just such a great game. And to be included in the official Thank sequel, the I mean, where do I sign, right? Like, where do I sign? And, uh, you know, it's, level two complete, by the way. Oh, thank, thank you. you very much, guys. So awesome. it's I'll been, shout out the subscriptions in a couple minutes. It's been almost a year, but it will be worth the wait. Uh, full disclosure, we just tried out the controls a little before this. That's why we were delayed. And, like, 
I had I had goosebumps like seeing some of this stuff, and we didn't even really play. I just saw like me walk down. Um, so I cannot wait to get this. I really can't wait to get that arcade cabinet. Oh, it's Bro, so nice. Full disclosure, I saw this, and at first I was like, "No, I have to get this. Eight hundred dollars." But Isn't it's gonna. Bad? It's going to look great in my toy room or in my little bar video game room. With and, and you on it? Hell yeah. Oh, not only am I on it, but like major pods in the game. I'm in the game. Like it has to be done. And uh -huh. that arcade machine is more than just wrestle, uh, more than just uh, Retromania. That, that's, you can, there's more games that you can get to put on that cabinet. The, the II arcade machine, if you oh, guys yeah. aren't familiar with it, check it out. It is an incredible piece of technology and well worth the money. Well, that's why I had the Game Marks podcast because I got out of the video games like N64. It got too hard for me, right? So when I saw when I saw this this cabinet, I thought it was one of those like virtual things. Like sometimes I get conned on eBay. Like, oh, there's a new Mac yeah. card, Mac credit card. Oh no, it's a it's a virtual card. Who wants a? I don't want a virtual card. I want a real card. So I thought this was like a virtual cabinet. Oh no no no, it's a real cabinet. A virtual. <laughs> <laughs> Well, they make virtual cars. Who, who collects virtual cars? Yeah. Well, in game, <laughs> you know? I guess. I mean, right. Anyway, long story short, we have a sample of the game. It comes out any day now. Um, I'm super 28th. excited. 28th. Yep. 26th. Six. Friday. 26th. Six. 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 Friday. Uh, we got some subs here. Uh, End purchase 69 gifted a sub. We got some bits from Mr. Quick USA. Joshua subscribing for two months. Thank you very much. Sean Allen subscribing. Tyler W subscribing. A uh, bunch of people sent bits. Thank you very much. Now, I want to, wow. before we jump into it, because I know we're, we're going to tr transition over into it in a couple of seconds, but I just want to set the stage so everyone knows exactly what to expect. I want to okay. set the hype level. So if you're around the ages of the four guys you see on your screen right now, you grew up pe playing for the WrestleFest. Shop. The, uh, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles arcade game. That is the line of graphics that we're talking about for this game. So if that if that ticks that nostalgia, if that makes you, like we say on the Game Marks podcast, put on those nostalgia goggles, this game is going to get you incredibly, incredibly hyped. But if you guys are ready, you. I'm ready. I'm ready. I, show. I don't know what I'm doing, but I say I'm always ready, so I gotta shoot I gotta show it right now. Alright, here we go. Oh, look at me right there. I look, I look great. Jack. So this is it. This is gold. the menu screen. This is what you see when you load up the game. You get your story mode, 10 pounds of gold, retro rumble, and versus. Versus what we're going to be doing. Set up all the way to an eight-man tag Woo. match. All right. We're we doing what? Fatal 4-Way? Fatal 4-Way. Uh, let's see. we go Tommy Dreamer. I am going to pick Colt. No one's going to be Bear Man on Brian? <laughs> I was going to be Brian, but then you I was going to pick Brian, but I assumed that. Stooge. You are a Johnny stooge. Johnny Retro's got cool moves. I am not a stooge. I'm going to be myself, of course. Can All we right. oh, 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 sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to figure out how to do this. There we go. All right, here we go. So. You have to be yourself. The Let's arenas. Oh, Retromania, school. We gotta be fall. in stomp because I'm Ooh. in the stomp room. No, no, you're not. You're no. in. You're right there, guys. And can we do that? Because look at this. Oh this... shit! <laughs> I am right there. You are right yeah. there, Marky. <laughs> guys, <literally> this... right <laughs> there. can you guys see? George, can you see me? Yeah. This is what it is based off of. This particular ring with all the stickers. This retro ring, and it is exact. We are playing in a toy major wrestling podcast retro ring and it's a perfect fit uh that's why i you know i love being a part of retro mania was the creative like you know what do you want to do uh can we have like a stop in paris arena can we be in a major wrestler podcast toy ring you got it's two Pro wrestling got Ryan two Barkins rings. in the game <laughs> so matt i'm gonna let you pick do you want to do stomp or do you want to do Major WF pod. Let's do regular major rest for podcast. Right. Just like that ring. All right, here we go, guys. That one's on the beach too, apparently. Oh, there's Tommy Dreamer, the oh, man yeah. I retired. And look in the crowd because Stang's in the crowd, I think. Right? Oh, he no. is yeah. prominent. So is the Super Bowl t shirt. You can right see there, him Super right Bowl. there. <laughs> Cabana. Thank you. Look, did here you see the Who's Lucy? Unreal. I love the graphics. It's so great. great. 
You want to talk nostalgic? Crap. Oh yeah, Diddy. hard foundation peg warmer. There I am. It's so L. great, I, baby. Oh, I love it. Wear that TTD gear. Really the amount busty of lady detail in the front row there. that they were able to <laughs> I get. I wasn't going to say it, Mark. <laughs> the amount of detail that they were able to get in this, you know, retro style. Uh oh. All right. <laughs> and the lights go out. So. Other than that, I want to explain, when me and George started, we ran through this a little bit this morning, and it actually worked, but George started by telling me multiple times, like, this is the prettiest game you're going to see. It is. It like is literally the prettiest game. But not only is it like WrestleFest, if you played the Fire Pro series, you'll notice that up top, under, like, um, your health bar, it shows which, it's like a little meter that shows which like grapple moves you can pull off. So there's the weak, the medium, and the like strong grapple move. So that's kind of like Fire Pro, but not as hard as that game because that game is ridiculously hard. All right, we're trying stop now. All Skip right, the entrance. Stop. all right. Go. Hey, okay. All right, there we go. So if you look, yeah. right, right next to that top left turnbuckle, oh. you see someone in the crowd wearing the silver ball shirt. I love it. <laughs> This Mark, am I still one of guys. Two to own that shirt? Uh, no, a couple, a bunch of people have the silver ball shirt. I can't talk when I'm playing video games. Get off my back. You're oh, live, yeah. pal. You gotta. Oh, 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 get out of my face! He's Who's Brian? Oh yeah! I'm oh, Brian. <laughs> <laughs> guys, this is the coolest thing like ever. This is like a bucket list thing, and you even know it's a bucket list to be in the game you played as a kid. Uh, wow. And it's the official sequel. It's not like some bootleg thing. You know, it's the real deal. This and I'm beating awesome. up Scotty Goldman over here. <laughs> oh, pile driver! Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Somehow this worked. Oh. Uh. What? 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 Someone's hitting what? random buttons and they're hitting the start button and making us leave the match. No way. <laughs> That's right, sorry. Broski. <laughs> well, how am I supposed to know? I didn't Someone's press start. Someone's just button mashing. <laughs> I'll pick a different person. All right, I'm going to be blue meaning. Although, I was killing it with the... Uh, uh, let's, play, let's play at uh, Pro Wrestling Tees. Okay. God dang it. <laughs> so, are there any, like, downloadable characters to this? Yep. Yeah, so they... they, they first day from Impact. They gave away some hints about who the next uh, round of... Well, I think the first one's Chris Bay, right? Uh, yeah, but they give to to the next to the next set. Okay. Because I I think we were originally going to be downloadable, and then with a little delay, we were able to just get in it for real, which I'm glad. Ooh. Warhorse looks great. Warhorse, like, hey, Warhorse is a little too jacked, I think. He's bigger like, than you. <laughs> I know, Warhorse. I love you, Warhorse, but like, come on. Listen oh, what the hell is that? You did like a. Of now, Broski, did they show. talk to you about your moves? Like, what moves do you want? Like, uh, I want, they, they, I want the arm ringer. You, like, uh, no, not like the arm ringer. Like, what, what finishers you want? What taunts? What gear? So we just send them all this different stuff. So uh, I actually played this with Clash this morning and was able to hit a uh, a lovely reboot on him. <laughs> really? It was yeah, awesome. Yeah. <laughs> It's pretty what cool. A, what about a little radio silence? We able to get that on or what? Trying, trying true. to figure out how we'll to hit that, that still. <laughs> there, there's, there's, uh, the finishers Holy. have eluded me so far, but I will, I'm going to figure it out. Dance. I remember on the original game, correct me if I'm wrong, to get energy back, you would corner. run the ropes. Uh, from what I remember? What is, this? is that, is that, is that just like me just making that up? I, from what I remember in the original game, when you wanted to regain your health, you, you put in a coin. <laughs> <laughs> well, then that's just me. What, what's that thing called where you, like the, where you, you remember something that's not real? Oh, uh, holy oh, shit. Power bomb. Whoa. Whoa. There he goes. That was nice. Hello, <laughs> baby. Yeah, we got to figure out finishing. I don't know how to do a move. There. So, wait, Mark, you're... Oh! You can only do light moves right now, Mark. You can't do full moves yet. So, so you'll see uh, next to your character's icon. Oh. 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 I'm being careful. So you might be able to answer this. How is this the official uh, sequel? Like, what makes this? Take that ref. Uh, that. Wait, I won. What? <laughs> I made, How? I made Matt submit into the uh, figure, uh, in the figure uh, four. Uh, <laughs> Let's keep playing. This is great. Mike Herman actually acquired the license to this, and I believe Matt Mania was the other one, George. Uh, yes, it's this and uh, to, to WrestleFest and Matt Mania. Right, so he just, you know, like Hawk and Animal were obviously the ones 
he needed in here because they're the mainstays of these games. They're pretty prominent in like the story mode and all that. Are you cheating, George? And People want to know. You just took it from uh, there. Yeah. So that that's the running thing is when I beat John in games, John gets bitter about no. it and he says that so, I cheat. So listen, shut up. So George will. George is the guy in No Mercy where you have your special and he goes outside the ring and avoids you, and it's annoying as shit. Oh, that's a, you're one of those players, huh? Lance, one of those. thanks for the subscription. What, I'm Jay. just supposed to take it. Alan yes. J subscription. <laughs> Norris, three bets. Thank you, Mr. Hokey. Look at Nick Aldis, NWA champion. So this is the the War Horse Arena. I love it. Oh, oh, yeah. Does Tommy do a little belly bump? Yes, he does. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh. we have the full disclosure, we're on Twitch, so I can't hear like any jingles or music, but I assume that's all there. Uh, double tap up and drop the chair to get back in the so ring. Dangerous. I know. I was, okay. I, I realized no one else knew how to get out of the ring and I yeah, wouldn't I be able to hit you. <laughs> uh, yeah, double tap your Can they hear the sound, the George? Yeah, not? everyone else can hear the sound. We can't because we're playing this very weirdly. I look incredible. I was just saying, the sprites in this game are awesome. The they did, they really Seriously, nailed like, it. The gear pops. The gear Holy! Gear. What the hell is that? You know, I like, I wish. Double tap up to get back in the rim, Marky. I wish we would have done uh, in retrospect. I'm hurt. I hate using the word retro again, but some retro mania figures of Brian. Ooh. Ooh. I wonder if we could still get some made, maybe. I want to explore this arena. Yeah, oh, so you pick up like these bones and stuff? No. Oh, kind of cool that the crowd is. Uh... You're gonna count it out, bud. Listen to this. Crowd. This oh. game is incredible. One. Ian, is the referee textbook. anybody? Uh, there actually are referees in here. It's Steve, it's ref Steve. There's saying. actually uh, Pat Savino. One is one of them. Man, I'm sneaking really away with hungry. the victory there. We, uh, we interviewed Ian Riccoboni last week about the being great game. He had similar stories also, how he would just play this at a laundromat, this and now he's literally right? How cool that is he played, that? right? Oh, this is amazing, guys. I, I actually would love to see what a competitor. somehow just a Has line ever ran the ropes of one? Retromania figures. Like, in this style, just I everyone in here in this style. That, I think that would be so cool. I'm trying to, I'm like, as I'm playing, oh, yeah. I'm thinking, like, how can we do this? Do what? Get like, the get the figures. Goes. Like, would, would they almost look like, um, like Legos? Like well, square no, pieces? I was thinking, like, have you ever seen the Ninja Turtle Mega figures that are painted to look pixelated? Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Like, I'd want it like that almost. Maybe like micro brawlers that are painted this way. Get up! Who's, who's dreaming? Oh, Wood Awakening! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's Get so great. up! Why are you just laying there, Alex? There oh, we go. Cla Clash is definitely Dreamer. What? <laughs> I am Dreamer. Why do you get so hurt from kicking out? Eli! <laughs> How do you climb the top rope? Uh... It's oh, there it is. Double tap. Oh, missile drop kick! They didn't, you didn't want them to give you the 450? History in the oh, it might be in there. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Hey, get off! That was textbook. Get off! <laughs> this this is drop kick. <laughs> We're all dead except for Tommy Dreamer. Oh! Hey. No! Oh, get out of here. <laughs> video proof Clash finally wins a game. Wow. Yeah. I'm just really good at video games, right, George? Can we pause for the cause here for a second? Let's catch up on the chat a little bit. Yeah, and then, absolutely. Uh, can we do a tag, Major Pod versus Game Marks? Absolutely. That might be a, a disaster. But you got to tell me how to tag. I don't. We haven't done a tag yeah, match. Let's not so do your a guess tag. is as good as no, mine. No, Broski, stop it. <laughs> Grow some balls. All right. So no time limit. You want to do a cage match? Tag team cage match. Big blue. They got big yes. blue in the chain link. Mark, look. Oh, we could do we could do tornado tag. There you go. Hey, wait. Ian Riccoboni is is here. He's watching. He's oh, hey. He's hey, man. What's up, man? What's up, what's up man? Ian, thanks for coming in. Uh, Game Marks Podcast had you on. Very great interview. And his micro brawl is right here. Look at that. He's everywhere. I got it too. It's, in, it's back in the detail. And if you listen to our episode this week, you could win a free Ian Riccoboni micro brawl. Oh, wow. wow. Yeah. All right. My, uh, Matt, Mark, Big Blue or Chain Link Cage? Big oh, Blue, Big baby. Blue. Big Blue. All right. We're going to do Tornado so we don't have to figure out how to tag. <laughs> All right. Mark, Mark sounded upset. Wait, which one are you guys? Both teams here. 
Are you guys left or right? Uh, so I'm player one. All right, so, so Broski, one, we're on the... Yeah, so... John, you're... Whatever one you're moving? Oh, God. Player one, stay where you are. I'm not moving. Hold on. Hit, hit back. Someone hit back. Um, George, you're player one? Uh, yeah. No, no, I'm okay, player so, two. No, I'll play a four. Okay. So wait. So I'm three then. Oh, right. uh, okay. Me and Matt are fine. Me okay. Are all right. Fine. So we're good. And here we go. To the I'm going to try pot. Johnny Retro again. Uh, you said you're never going to tag with Brian again unless it's against the headbang, <laughs> but you were wrong because you're tagging we do. Against Johnny Retro and Tommy Dreamer. Johnny Retro and Colt. What are you thinking? They're all Colt. pretty good options. Nikita Colt. Colt. <laughs> Colt in a cage. He's always wanted Matt in a cage. Matt, you still there? I'm right here. Mark, you didn't delete the booze in. Oh, I'll delete it in a little bit. Uh, all right. What arena like do we want? Do we want, right to try, do we want to try Major Pod Arena again? See yeah, the crashes? <laughs> yeah, I want to see House of Hardcore, too. Oh, oh yeah. Let's do that. Where is that? There it is. Yeah. House of Hardcore. Did you delete it, Matt? No, I don't oh, have it. Look oh, at that. look at that. That is that. sick. Wow. The tag entrance is cool. Your lady in the crowd's gone, Mark. Oh, oh yes. this is so. This is awesome. All right. Yeah. This is fantastic. Oh. I, love... <laughs> I love how the cage just dropped. I was just texting Johnny before, and now I'm beating his ass. <laughs> Name drop. Can you hear my buttons? No. Yeah. A little bit. I, I, I think we can hear oh, it. Oh, holy, what was that? L.I. So what, they first uh, showed me the taunt for this. I'm like, uh, guys, it's the other way. I hit, you know, like, I was like, oh, but that's, DDT. A, but that's You're not great, ill? That's the great stuff about uh, Retromania is that they give us, like, input. Like, Mark, normal, you're Brian? Normal yeah. company would just made it. It would have been wrong. You know what I'm saying? 2K20? Giorgio. Ian, fuck you <laughs> on <laughs> George needs help over. <laughs> oh, what the hell was that? Oh wait, you know what I just realized? I could probably do some double team moves here. He's looking to make quick oh, work wow. of him. <laughs> Can you do double teams in Russell Plus like Doomsday Device? I'm pretty sure. I think some of them are set up where just like double grapples in the ring, like no mercy style, and then other ones are set up uh, from the like a tagging. So there is a Doomsday Device, or no? We don't. Yeah, know I'm so. pretty sure there is. Oh, Rude Awakening! You see that? That's beautiful move. Oh. Oh, Mark is, is destroying me right now. I, I can't figure out how to get to the top. I did it earlier. Wait, what the hell is this move? I just keep trying to run. <laughs> what is this yeah. move that, that Colt <laughs> goes to do? <laughs> Suck it. Holy crap, Spear. That's like the ninth time Colt Spear. Take this move. Oh, yeah. I see Brian do that in practice. <laughs> it's the worst move ever. Oh, my God. It, like, takes the wind out of you. What, which one is that? Just like the back does, suplex. Whenever he's oh, doing oh. drill, yeah, why does he do just, that? Even his suplex is stiff. Because he like has you up in the air, and then he takes like a full blown like jumping back. Yes, up. and then he right? swings as hard as he can. Right? Like why do you do that, right? Like oh, especially to a like a two week student just just because. Oh, he's not it's not a regular suplex. <laughs> you fall. He like does a corner. jumping back bump and stiffs you. I can see the Reddit post now. Brian and I are stiff students. <laughs> Oh! oh! Now, uh, there is a piece of commentary goes. every time you throw a punch, Matt, and it yeah. makes, uh, and it says, uh, uh, Cardona's strikes are as stiff as an action figure. I like it. That's great. Pure domination. Oh, stop and, it with And that. I have to assume, like, the entrance music is, like, midis of, like, our song? Uh, it's, it's definitely, like, a midi chip tune format, um, and every, cool. every wrestler has their, has their, uh, a unique entrance theme? Oh my god. Broski, if I get pinned, you gotta break it up! Break it up, Broski! No! Right. Oh, oh save win! Oh! Down oh. he goes! Ooh, he's making a statement tonight! Second win, mother effer. Oh! Oh crap! Oh, this spike DDT! Broski, help me! Bro, I'm trying to figure out how to play! <laughs> oh! We're just jumping at each other. So what, one day I'll explain it. The, the controls oh, better. Oh, they spiked it! Did he climb? 
I'm the cage. That's what. Listen to this crowd. Oh yeah, I guess it's anybody's that's... ball game here, guys. Anybody's ball game. Someone tell me how to climb. I think oh, I just punched the ref. <laughs> Ooh. I'm dead. Right. I think I'm dead. Can can I? How do I climb the cage? Come on, come on, come on! Stop it! I just want oh! to pin, pin his ass. Is this a fatal four-way or a tag? It's tag match. It's a tag, but it's tornado, dude. This is what he does. You haven't done a lot of tornado Big uh, game matches. What does that mean? So, come on! No tags. You never played a video game? No. So who's oh, my partner? It. It's you and Mark versus me and. But who's my? Who's the character partner? Down he goes. Okay. Are you serious? You just crowd. figured that out? <laughs> no. Stars. No. We won. Wait, did no, we win? Did not. Nope, you lost. <laughs> Wait, did Brian just pin me? No. No. It was Johnny Retro, baby. Uh, Guys, I think, I think that's, that was uh, some good playing right there. Yeah, all right. I'm going to switch it back over to the full screen. That was great. And we're definitely going to be streaming this on Friday. Oh, yes. 100%. I'm playing, I'm playing the shit out of this. This is, yeah. and I'm, I'm, not, I'm not joking. I am going to lose hours of my life in, in this game. Like, it's, I it's want to play the story. I'm playing the story on this very channel. So what are the different stories? So the, the story mode is just, you know, you play through the story. Um, George, can I see you? Make make it so I can see you. Okay. Guys, Retro, Retro, Retro Mania is actually in the chat right now, too. Oh, oh, wow. Look at that. And they want us to do a rumble. I'm just saying. This game sucks. Uh, no, stop. This game is awesome. That was great. This was, this was such a good game. So cool. That was literally everything I wanted in a game. Right? And, and I'm not even just saying that. So... For those of you who watched my stream last night, I actually tried RetroFest on this very channel. I'm sorry, not RetroFest. WrestleFest, Wrestle Fest. the original. And I was horrible, and it was not even close to as fun as that. This has wow. so many cool moves and the controlling and the... And that, George, only you can do a Royal Rumble or a tag match. What is that? I, I mean, that's, that's, you got to remember, this is an arcade cabinet. That, that's yeah. what that game was, you know, yeah. that, that. Yeah, but one versus one, come on. That game is designed to eat quarters. Right. Like right. this, okay. the, what you're getting now in Retromania is a much more well, well-rounded, more balanced experience. You know, it's, it's not just like a one and done. There's things in there to keep you playing so that you don't just like do it once and then you're done with it. There's a story mode. There's 10 pounds of gold. There's the retro rumble. There's versus mode. And, you know, we talk about this a lot on our podcast that 99% of the time for our generation, and obviously this goes moving forward, versus mode is really where you're gonna spend a lot of time because you're playing with your friends, you're playing with family members, you're playing you know, online, but a lot of the times you lose out or you miss out on that story mode. And Retro, uh, Retro Mania has done such a good job bringing you back into that. Like the what you've seen from the story, the stills, the, the incredible artwork, uh, the 10 pounds of gold mode, like all of those things, like I, I cannot wait to have more time to dive into this and yeah. we'll absolutely be doing that on Friday. And then get better at the game. Yeah, well, I, I, I want to I wanna try to pace myself with you guys that way because if I'm playing and oh, Johnny's playing shut. and then we get better <laughs> and then... Uh... So guys, correct me if I'm wrong, this comes out on like real systems like Xbox or whatever. Yeah, yeah but not you for a couple also, weeks. But you could also get it uh, Friday streaming like so on a computer is that what that means? Yeah. So this game on Steam is on Steam. Yeah. So okay. Steam is if you're not familiar with Steam, um, much like how Xbox Live or the Xbox Live Arcade, how that's like a platform for you to get uh, your games. Steam is a platform for you to have games on your computer. Um, there are a couple different platforms okay. like that. Steam is the one that's been around the longest. It's it's the most trusted of all of them in terms of the libraries are huge. Um, you know, they, they've got everything on there and yeah. you can get so many games. So once I heard- Toilet Bowl that, Simulator. Exactly, they have everything. Uh, so once, if you're, if you're a computer gamer, once you heard that this was coming to Steam, it, it ticks all the boxes. It's a quality game. It looks good. It runs well. It sounds amazing. Uh, so to have all that, in a convenient spot on Steam, it just makes streaming and playing this game so much easier. So I, I'm a huge fan of that. Um, I know John's familiar with Steam. Mark is familiar with Steam. I'm sure there's a bunch of people in chat who are also familiar. Oh yeah, I'm getting it. <clears throat> well, now I gotta be familiar because I don't have any consoles. So I, the last thing I have is N64. 
Oh, don't oh. worry. I'll help you with that. You'll be so fine. I need to get that. And then I need to get the, it's the II Arcade or I Arcade? The II Arcade is the, is the, is the big cabinet. That's the big boy that yeah. I need. I feel like yep. that's where you're going to really spend most oh, of yeah. your time playing this game. And, so and I'll have Chelsea, so. babe, Chelsea, look, look, I'm in the game. <laughs> yeah, uh, I'll have that. I have the, uh, the one, the one up Ninja Turtles. Right. I have that. That's great. So like height wise, what's the, what's the, do you guys know the, the size difference between that and like a one up? Um, I know Similar. Retromania is still in the chat. I just saw them chat. So if they have the specs in terms of the height and width of the arcade machine, uh, I don't have that ready. Um, but I know I know that the that's definitely are fairly small, right? Without the platform. No, I mean, Turtles came with the platform. Yeah. I think I, I the arcade is both. Like it comes with the with the platform, and it can just be the the, the bar top. Um, mm. So you can get. You can get uh, either one, but oh wait, uh, oh Retromania says uh, check out the social streams tomorrow for the DLC reveal. They're announcing two wrestlers. Woo! Retromania, can we get Smart Mark Sterling in the game? I know that I was in the running <laughs> to be in this game originally. You're in the I, game. Yeah, but I want to play. He wants I to step get away that from that commentary chair. desk and, and get in and it. And I want to play. <laughs> well, if you're gonna use some major WPOD IP, then that needs to be a little bit of cut. Wait. <laughs> Smart okay, Mark so here Sterling we go. Is not major W product. <laughs> here we go. The I arcade is 61 inches high, whereas the TMNT arcade one up is 48, and is so 57 with the riser. Wow. So it's a, it's almost the same. It's a few inches bigger. Oh, it's, okay. it's bigger. It's bigger, yeah. better, better. Yeah. You're gonna be able to see that that amazing graphic, that amazing wrap, even oh, better. I, bro, like this is so cool. It's like it's a little kid. You know, me wanting to be a wrestler, you always hope you can have a t-shirt, get a figure, be in a video game, but not just any video game. You're in like the video game. You oh, know? yeah. Like, be that sequel. It's, oh man, it's so cool. This is without a doubt the most hype sequel to a video game in the last decade for sure. Like, And I, and I will say Retro Soft, Retro Mania, hell of a job on that social media, you know, with that, that hype. That yeah. hype train has been, you know, a whole year. Oh, a year plus. Yeah. Even the you vlogs know? on YouTube, they've been yeah. keeping us hyped. And that's the thing that we've been talking about so much on our podcast is that the, and, and you guys have mentioned it too on Major Wrestling Figure Podcast, is that the transparency is, is what you love to see from game developers. You know, this is where we're at. Here are some screenshots. Here are some, you know, you know this is what the artwork's gonna look like. Here's like a snippet of someone's entrance. Th those are the things that you love to see, not only because it shows that a company is developing and putting the work into the game, you know, no matter how big or small the amount of work is, some teams are bigger, some teams are smaller, but just to be able to see the progress, it, it, it fuels the fire. Yeah, and it keeps the fans along for the ride. Exactly. You know, they feel invested. They feel a part of the process. They're rooting for the game. That means like they can't wait to buy the game when it comes out. Uh, and I, I wish more. You know, I'm full disclosure. I'm not a video game guy anymore. But I I can only assume that you guys wish more video game developers were the same. Like I wish more toy companies were the same. Yeah. But they're more transparent and let you in. We want to come on. We know there's going to be a finished product. Let us in on the process. Oh yeah. I mean that's all we're asking for. The the vote for that that got Warhorse into the game. That, that alone incredible. is a huge, huge thing. Getting so many people involved. With I was part of that vote. And, <laughs> and, and you were close. <laughs> but I, I, saw someone, I saw someone in the chat say that they would like to see a, a, a Major Pod Network DLC. And I, 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 I would sign off on that one. <laughs> <laughs> what, what would your finisher be? I just That's what I want to know. Ah, uh, the, the cheat, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> You just oh. pull out a gun. Are we gonna see? Are we gonna see your finisher at FWF Live on April eighth? Hey, We're Johnny's been teaching too. me some moves here, so I'm, I'm I ready can't wait to, to go. See George's gear. Yeah, George. Like, where do you come from, George? <laughs> where, uh, so I've known Mark. I've been one a, a, a good friend of Mark for for a while. I helped him design all his his gear and stuff like that. Me and George had designer heat. That's and then, where yeah. this came from. And then me and Johnny got into somehow. a fight on Twitter. And yeah, George uh, was my designer. We just we started this podcast as a joke, and then it ended up being where we both had a lot in common, and that was it. it so just, like I thought, I just assumed you were like George's friend. Uh, I mean, sorry, uh, Clash's friend from high school or something. No. There was actually a running nope. joke that uh, in in the Creator Pro world, uh, I was just known as Mark's friend George for the <laughs> longest time. Like people would just refer to me as Mark's friend George. And are you really Mark's friend or just like an online friend? No, I I I know Mark. Mark was at my wedding. <laughs> oh really? 
Yeah. Was he wearing his hoop earrings? At technically. <laughs> technically. It was like two years ago. I was say, technically, Matt, you were also at my wedding. <laughs> oh, yeah. You sent them a... Uh, you sent you me sent and my wife a, nice a video congratulating us. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> we got to oh, play man. that. Did do we got to play it. Did you, Mark, did you ask me to do it and I did it? Yeah. Can we play that now? Does somebody have uh, that in handy? I, you never sent it to me, Mark. It lives on Facebook, I think. Oh, <laughs> I posted damn. it on his Facebook, so you'd have to, you'd have to get it. Oh, we need I'll, to, I'll we find need to it. That somewhere. I'll find yeah. it. I'll, I'll share it with you guys. Well, it's congratulations. Nice, nice you, you were shirtless. <laughs> I was shirtless. <laughs> I no, I'm pretty sure Probably. you played it on the big you screen were, at the wedding. <laughs> yeah, we, oh, we, we blew it up. We we sent it to the to the projector. No, uh, you were just it was like your dress now, just cut off. So wait, like so uh, we're we're a little off track here. So were you a huge like Zack Ryder friend, or was like I the only wrestling friend that Mark had that would do this video? I mean. Both? <laughs> Nobody could be a re he was a re dude. He's a wrestling fan who lived on Long Island. There's yeah. no way he's not a Zach. Yeah. Guy. Like oh, okay. I, I know I know people who know you and have like 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 we can like six ways of Kevin Bacon me me knowing you, but Okay. Yeah, so cool. it made sense. And now you're part of the major pod network. I say now you're my boss. Yeah. <laughs> that's, right, that's right. Your boss gets you're fired. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Thanks for setting up. <laughs> now you're fired. I mean, if you're ever going to do it, this is the platform to do it on. No, no. I mean, I already announced the big tag match at FWF Live April 8th. I hope you get some. And if gear. you lose. Maybe this is the, the no, this oh, is the, it, the network implodes. That's what it's, that's it, it's, <laughs> it's not a career match. Um, but I'm glad you guys are on board. I love the pod. Uh, I love. I listened today to the uh, the WrestleFest two, which I was uh, just going through my Facebook memories, and it popped up that I was like in that game. So I don't know if it, like you planned it that way that it was released or what. I mean, we, we wanted we, to cover we, it. We did it to coincide with the yeah. release of, of oh wow uh, of Retromania. So it just happened to work out that it's all on the same timeline. Yeah, I mean, I was I was pumped to be in that game. But I'm like even more pumped to be in this, you know what I'm saying? And, and like it's gonna be in the actual arcade cabinet, uh, super cool. So I, I can't wait. But if it comes out on like Xbox or whatever, I still need that for my collection. Well, if I'm on the cover, if I'm not on the cover, then I don't need it. <laughs> <laughs> Am I on the cover or what? Well, uh, who are we sure. raiding, guys? Who, who should we raid? Who's who are we gonna raid? Hey, let's let's thank Retromania uh, yeah. for for sending us a sample. Oh, thanks absolutely. Ian Riccoboni for yeah, popping thank you for in. everything. Yeah, this, yeah is, this is great. You know, th thanks for sending us the, the early release. Thanks for making this game. Uh, thanks for just, you know, keeping everybody in the loop during the development. I mean, this is, could not ask for anything more from a game developer as, uh, as four gamers, regardless of how active any of us may be. Uh, th these are the kind of things that you want to see when you're working with a game development company. I literally sent pictures of this ring on my carpeted floor, and it is in the video game. How <laughs> cool is that? And tomorrow night on YouTube, youtube.com slash Podcast, check out GMP64, where we play No Mercy against each other. We each have a roster similar to FWF. Bye, everybody. Bye. See ya. Bye.